It is Sunday, August 10th, 2014. It's about 10.35 in the evening. And uh, long time no talk. Anyway, uh, if you notice, it's been about five weeks or so since I made a video. Um, unfortunately, well, fortunately, unfortunately, how you look at it, I've been out of uh, town for three weeks uh, straight, pretty much. Uh, had uh, meetings for work, uh, trainings, all that good management stuff that, uh, you know, makes the world go round and round, I guess. So, um, and then about a week and a half before that, um, my MacBook actually took a uh, turn for the worst. The keypad and uh, touchpad, keyboard touchpad stuff working on it. So, I haven't uh, made any videos. Now, some of you say, oh, you could have made them and just post them later. Yeah, but then it, you know, I've just been busy with work, so... I wouldn't have had time to make them anyway, um, unless I would have just made a few, um, you know, like four or five weeks ago, and then I would have had to wait to, to render them, so it would have made no difference, so. Anyway, that being said, I haven't, uh, I think the last video we did was probably Retro Entertainment, I think. I don't remember. Um, I believe it was. Um, obviously, there's no new cases of those out yet, so we're waiting for, I think it's the E-Case, so hopefully that'll be out soon. And I'm not going to open up any Johnny Lightnings today because I actually have something else to open up. Um, again, I just got the computer back on Friday. And actually, was it Saturday? My wife and I were out and um, she needed some new earplugs. So uh, we stopped in Walmart and it's the first time I've looked for Hot Wheels in, in a you know Walmart or anything for a long time. But there was one out that I knew I wanted. So um, I got lucky and found them couldn't believe it. It's the BMW E36 M3 race. And if you guys watch my other channel or know me, you know I have a BMW M3, an E36 series. It's not white, but it is my track car, so it's uh, silver, and it is, again, an E36 M3. So when I saw this was coming out, I had to get them. You notice I said them. So I got everyone they had. So we got, uh, and I, I, you know, I'm not trading them or anything like that. I'm just keeping them all. So there's three there, two more. I got six. Now we're going to crack one, obviously. This is going to be the one we're going to crack because of the condition of the packaging. And then I'm going to put one in the card, and then the, S, the rest of them I put in a box, and I just save them with all my other M3s, which uh, I'll probably show you those, maybe. I don't know. We'll see. And eh, maybe in another video. So, we're going to go ahead and crack one here. I would have bought, uh, if they would have had 20, I would have got them all. So, um, they only had six that I could find. So, obviously, this is the main lines. So, hopefully, they'll make something else. But anyway, being a main line, just, uh, and I'll probably customize one too. I don't know if I forgot to mention that. But being a main line, it's plastic base, plastic wheels. All that good stuff. No painted front as far as the headlights or the grill or anything like that. It does have the chicory. Now this is a real car. They do make an E36 M3 uh, track car, a race car, and it looks pretty close to this. Got the big wing in the back. Got the checkering on it. Although the back end of this, it's a little bit more rounded. I mean, it is an E36, but they almost look like they have an E46 kind of back end on it. A little bit more rounded than it should be. But it's close enough. But notice no painted taillights, none of that. It looks like they did put a little provision in there for the um, <laughs> for the tow hook though. See that little square? That's where the tow hook hook is on the cars. On my car even. So there it is. We'll go ahead and put on a little display here. Kinda of funny that they would put uh, put that on there. But no other detail. Of course, that's part of the actual casting, but it would be nice if they would have maybe painted some things. So we'll have to customize one, maybe. If you watch the channel, you know me customizing. I seem to never really get to it or finish painting them, as somebody keeps on reminding me of. <clears throat> I'm not going to mention any names. I should, but I'm not. <laughs> I'll send you a text later. Zoom up a little bit more, we'll get a nice detail there. So this probably will become, um, I'm sure at some point, it's going to you know, become a, like a main area, uh, part of a series, I hope. 
I really hope, because the M3, actually, the E30, the E30 M3, was part of the, uh, part of a series before it ever came, um, out, so, that one was, so this one has not been, that I'm aware of, so hopefully it will be, but, Uh, again, we're gonna crack, you know, crack one. We'll put one away in a package uh, or in a uh, protecto pack, and the other one we'll just put in a box. I'm just trying to find the nicest one. To That's been up. So I had to look for my protecto packs. There we go. We've got one protective pack now. You can barely see that in the background. So that's going to do it. Hopefully, we'll uh, they can get caught up on things. We'll do some customs, and hopefully, they come out with some more retros here soon. I'm already jonesing, and uh, some Johnny Lightnings. That's it. If you have any questions or comments? Post those below. Subscribe and thanks for watching.